Throughout the My Top Billing Dream reality show, Linnell revealed a rare human touch. Her vocal talent is undeniable, but her ability to bring opera to people who might never have enjoyed it is a unique talent. Linnell! <laughs> Linnell, what a way to catch me! Look at you, you look gorgeous! <laughs> Ah, oh, thank you. I'm actually not in my costume yet, no, but, but... I just don't know why you're so calm because I'm actually freaking out on your behalf. I mean, how are you feeling? I'm actually just faking. <laughs> it helps that I have, obviously, experience, so I can, I can hide it, but the nerves, the adrenaline, it's right there. I can feel it in my, my fingers. Like, please don't look nervous around me because then I'll start feeling nervous. This is such an amazing opportunity to perform with one of the best opera singers in the world. Incredible, incredible. The biggest classical opera star in, in, in history. I mean, are you, are you kidding me? And she's right here, and I'm singing in a concert. It's, it's mind-blowing. And you know, this is actually thanks to you. To me? To you. Do you remember when we had the auditions in Cape Town, the prelim rounds? You were the first person to ask me to sing. I'm actually, I'm falling in love, so stop it. Stop it. Oh, that was no Oh my gosh. That was brilliant. And since then, people realized that I was a singer and it snowballed. And how exactly has your dream grown from the beginning to now? You know, sometimes one is so scared to dream big because you, you don't even know what your own potential is. And being chosen for the top 10 was such an, a dream come true already. And going from there to singing at the fashion show, first of all, in Canal Walk. <laughs> to going even bigger with performing with Catherine at the finale and then her inviting me to perform in her show. It's just skyrocketed into avenues that I could have never predicted. And it, it's an encouragement to keep on dreaming even bigger because the bigger you dream, the bigger your dreams can come true. I might shed a tear. I might shed a tear. <laughs> Please. But listen, I'm going to leave you. Leave you in peace now. You need to rehearse. All the best. Okay, thank you so much. <laughs> Let me start warming up again. Now, you've given her the opportunity of a lifetime tonight. What made you make that decision? Well, you know, what's lovely about what I get to do is I get to travel and meet lovely people and talented people. And um, I think that she's a really lovely girl. I heard about her mum and that her mum has this wish to see her perform on the stage. And I thought, why not share this with her? Because I'm very lucky. I feel lucky that I get to do this myself. So I wanted to share this with her and give her the opportunity. Honestly, from my side, one of the most selfless acts I've ever come across here. I mean, we, we honestly, we are humbled by what oh, you've done here tonight. It is, it is so special. The orchestra awaited, and the pride of a home crowd was riding on her performance. Can we welcome to the stage the wonderful Linnell Kennard. A superstar, one in the making, and a third remarkable woman here was Linnell's mum, Christine Kennard, whose resolve to fight cancer so she could live to see occasions like this was about to earn a great reward. Je veux You were absolutely amazing. Thanks so much, Inez. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, listen to the people. They're screaming for you. It's unbelievable. How was it out there? Oh, it was just wonderful. I'm still, like, I don't know what's going on with my body. I'm, I'm shaking. It was amazing. I wanted it to go on longer. I was backstage. I had, I had goosebumps. I had a lump in my throat, and I almost shed a tear. You are going to become a superstar. Oh, thanks, Inez. Next time, I'm going to get that tear out of you. Lord, Lord.